Hello, welcome back to another beer review. Now, as you can see, I've got a book. <laughs> we're off to Poland. Um, we're going to Poland. We're going to um, a brewer which the flagship beer is a is a Pilsner. It says it. It's a Pilsner, and I had it at the beginning of the year, and it was. Um, really really good Pilsner one of the best Pilsners I think I've ever had so I thought <coughs> I'll do a little bit of research on this one and um, this brewer uh, was first founded in 1846 um, and it was nationalised by the communist government in Poland in 1948 there you go <laughs> there you go <laughs> we got um, Perla Mopna in the can. There you go, boys and girls. Super smashing great. 7.6% ABV. Perla meaning pearl in, in Poland. Um, I think it could be a reference to the bubbles. Going, you know, the, the bubbles in the beer. Maybe they look like pearls. If you know what I mean. So, yeah, Pearl Mopna. Um... 7.6. I hope it's as good as the Pilsner. So, let's see what we get. Clear the old nasal passage like you do. It smells of, of, of grape. It smells to me of dark grape. Um, blackberries. Blackberries, brambles, you know, that type of thing. Maybe tin prunes. But for me, it smells like a hint of black currant in there as well. It, it, it's got that type of aroma about it, if you know what I mean. So let's whack her in the glass. And see what we get, you know. As I keep saying, Polish beers very deceiving. Um, what you think tastes quite um, weak for a weak beer, if you know what I mean. It's actually a strong beer. Am I making sense? So pour out. I made a muck up of that, as you can see. Absolute. <laughs> Absolute mess of that. Right, first of all, boys and girls, most important, one of life, life's lessons this is, what you need to do when you pour a beer is to concentrate on pouring the beer and not jibber jabbering all the time about stuff. You know what I mean? So that is a very important lesson because that's what happened just then. I'm just talking away like I am. <sighs> Didn't even think when the beer was at the top. So, waffling on. Um, as you can see, it is um, quite a dark gold, very clear looking beer. Um, head's just plopping down, behaving itself at last, as you can see, and a column of carbonation just floating up, and they look like pearls, if you know what I mean. So yeah, old brewery, old traditional Polish brewery, should I say. See what we get, well I know what it tastes like now, <laughs> so see what we get. And it's the same you know, dark greatness, black current type of thing, bramble type of thing going on. Um, and you get a nice burnt maltness, I would say. Roasted maltness in the background. But it all smells very, very pleasant. So, I'm going to go in. Cheers. First off, the alcohol in this, you do pick it up as you go in. 
and it feels a little bit med medicinal, if you know what I mean. It feels a bit medicinal in 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 the way the alcohol feels. It, it, it's it's a weird thing to put into into words, really. I'm going again. That alcohol feels feels like the alcohol you get in whiskey as you go in. There's a slight when I just drunk it there. Honestly, to God, it felt like I was picking out something from a glass of whiskey. You do get a nice fruit, um, a, a, a nice fruit note in there, like a, a, a black currant, like a prune. Like a dark fruit type of note in there. It does feel it's got a lovely texture to it around the mouth. Hmm. Pick it up. It's like a. Imagine having a shot of whiskey and neat whiskey, and you get that type of grain flavour you get from a whiskey, you know, it's like a, like a malt flavour with, with the alcohol, like, imagine a malt with coating in alcohol, that type of thing, from, <laughs> I'm not a whiskey drinker by the way, <laughs> you're getting that in this. So for me, that you do get the essence of the strength. Um, it is it, it. Then you get a, a hint of kind of like dark, kind of like fruitness to it. A lovely smooth mouthfeel uh, around the mouth. It, it does feel that in it, and it 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 is okay. It's okay, but for me, their pilsner was a belter. This in, in, in no way is as good as their Pilsner. Um, out of the stronger Polish beers, I have to think the Ocotim for me suited me down to the ground. This is still pleasant. Um, it's still a pleasant beer. I'm going to go in one more time. Because I'm completely blown this with you. I really have. I think I've kind of gone off on one. Little bit of whiskey. <laughs> Boys and girls. I've got to get a grip. Perla. Mokna. 7.6% ABV. Give it a whirl yourselves. Tell me what you think. Um, it's, it's okay. It's an okay strong beer. If you know what I mean. And on that score, I'm 8 minutes in. If you haven't fallen asleep already... In this review and you're still awake watching me go on and go on and go on thank you very much i really appreciate it on that score see you on my next one. Oh, by the way every one of you you're all stars cheers <laughs>